Finally, over the last 10 weeks, we've introduced you to many talented local musicians in our Cleveland Breakout Concert Series. This week's trio is no exception. On our final edition of the Breakout, our man on music, Dave Tarber, shows you how the exotic birds have made modern music very popular in this area. Modern technology has changed the way we all work and play. It has even changed the way the human art form of music is made. Computer composer Thomas Dolby blinded us with science in 1982 with his computerized high-tech sound. He defends the accusation that his synthesized style takes the human element out of music. I'm just using the most up-to-date tools available to make my music. It's almost as though the computer is my instrument the way the piano is Elton John's or the guitar is Johnny Mitchell's. You know, it's my accompaniment for my songs. <laughs> For six years, talented Cleveland band Exotic Birds have produced their unique electric dance music with the aid of computers. They use a technique known as sampling, which entails programming sequences of sounds into the computer to be recalled during the performance. Like Thomas Dolby, the birds contend that for their style, the computer is an essential element of the music. Our particular style of music is a very dance-oriented kind of thing that, um, that is an element of the song. It would sound bad if a human was trying to play 16th notes throughout a song. It doesn't make any difference how a song is played. If it's a good song, and people like the song, whether it's a rock and roll song, whether it's a disco song, whether it's, you know, a polka, it doesn't matter. We just use different instruments than other people do, and I refer to the computers as instruments. The misconception Andy and Trent feel most people have about their computer is that it creates the music itself. In fact, just like any computer, the musical computer must be programmed. It doesn't create, it recreates. It's only as talented as its programmer. When you mention talent and creativity, that blend equals the exotic bird. The exotic birds caught the eye and ear of the music industry when they opened for the Culture Club in 84 at the Coliseum. This year promises to soar the birds to new heights. The past 10 weeks we've seen a great example of the musical talent in our city. Hopefully in 87 we'll let the rest of the nation in on our secret. I'm the man on music, Dave Tarbert, for Live on 5. It's hard to imagine. Ten